What's up everybody, Pat Flynn here, and man, we are coming up to the end of the year here. This is episode 36 of SPI TV, and I just wanted to give you a recap before we close in the year here uh, of my top five favorite episodes of SPI TV uh, for the year. And so I wanna give a big shout out to Caleb Wojcik, who's behind the camera right now, Tim back there behind me, who is working on the editing actually right now for some other videos, and uh, to you for watching SPI TV, whether this is the first episode you've watched or you've watched them all, thank you so much. Here's the top five episodes my favorite from 2015. Woo! All right, number five, that is how to write a book, how to create a super fast first draft, which was actually episode one of SPI TV. And this is actually one of the, actually the highest viewed episode of SPI TV for the year. So go ahead and check it out. It's fun because we talk about how to create that first draft really fast. And of course, a lot of you know, I have a book coming out in February of 2015 or 16. Actually, we're doing some time travel here. Next year, February, look out for my book. And uh, in this episode, you're gonna see a lot of post-it notes and also a cool trick to help you with uh, dictation into transcriptions to help you get that first draft, which is what I've learned, just a small part of the process, but a very crucial part. So go ahead and check it out. That's again, episode one. Number four. Top 10 places on your website to place an opt-in form. This is a very actionable episode of SPI TV, episode 27, which will show you exactly that. Where on your website can you put opt-in forms? Already, this one is actually the one that I've gotten the most emails about because people are saying that it's been the most useful. And just even including one of those 10 places into your website that you don't have already can make a drastic change in your email list conversion. So go ahead and check that out. Again, that's episode 27. Uh, I pr I'm pretty sure that you don't have them all. So go ahead and check it out. Implement one to begin with, and you're gonna see massive change, and then you can include the rest after that. So again, episode one, there you go, or not episode one. I'm losing it. That's uh, episode 27, number four. I don't know where one came from, but we're, we're getting there, so stick with me. All right, number three, top episode of SPI TV for 2015 is actually my presentation at NMX, where I came out in a DeLorean. And so the whole thing is there for you. You can watch it. It's episode 13, I believe. Yeah, 13. And uh, in that, I uh, roll out in a DeLorean, which was done because it has to do with the presentation, which is about the past, present, and future of building brands and surviving the test of time. And also because I'm a huge Back to the Future fan and I was living out my childhood dream. So you can go ahead and check that out. Again, that's episode 13. You're going to learn about what uh, companies do to survive as technology changes. What can you do? What principles can you use over time, no matter what time uh, in, or what era we're in in business, it's always worked. And so you can find those principles there and uh, it's a lot of fun. One of my favorite presentations that I've done, not just for the Back to the Future thing, but because it's, it's high quality content too. So you can check it out, that's number three. What's number two? What was I gonna say? Oh, <laughs> okay, second favorite episode of SPI TV for the year is actually day one of my trip to Ghana. Actually, I brought Caleb and I, uh, I brought myself too. Um, to Ghana and we filmed our entire trip and it was amazing, you know and Thank you to those of you who helped to donate to that campaign to build a couple schools in Ghana We actually visited the schools that that money went toward and saw a number of other schools Celebrations a lot of dancing and I even got involved too, which was kind of fun uh, And it was a very very eye-opening experience for me I came home from that trip realizing just how much I have to be thankful for and how much education plays a role. I mean, we kind of take for granted what we have access to, which is why these campaigns are very important, why I love Pencils of Promise, and I've since become uh, an advisor for the foundation um, and organization. But you know, beyond that, I still continue to help them and others too. I've been doing some more philanthropic stuff locally, helping teach kids in homeless orphanages and, or homeless shelters and um, things like that uh, around uh, the local area where I live. And, you know, it's just, I get such a good feeling when I give and it's always, when you give, you get back and uh, it might not be right away, but I encourage you to, as you move forward and especially into 2016 to see if you can find other ways to, to give back to those less fortunate than us. And so uh, thank you again for those of you who supported that. And uh, let's uh, get into uh, the favorite, number one favorite video of the year. <laughs> that is the office tour. This is by far the most commented and the most tweeted about episode of SPI TV. And that is my hero cam virtual, not virtual, it's actually a real tour, of my home office. I built that home office from scratch. Uh, my wife and I were very lucky to buy a new home very recently in the last couple of years. And that uh, room was a blank slate. 
And so I used my architectural knowledge, knowledge. and an, an interior designer that we hired to build it in the exact way that I needed it to be built for maximum productivity. There are specific spaces in that room, as you'll see if you watch that episode again. That's episode two of, uh, of SPI TV, and uh, I think you'll enjoy it. Actually, a lot of people have said that they've used that as a foundation for their new renovations for their own offices, too. And if anything, it'll at least give you some idea on how I work and you know how I stay productive and how spaces matter in that whole uh, arena. So again, thank you so much for watching SPI TV. All those episodes, again, just to recap really quick, number five, how to write a book, get that first draft done really fast, that's episode number one. Number four, top 10 places on your website to include an opt-in form, that's episode 27. And then episode 13, that's number three, which is the New Media Expo DeLorean presentation, how to future-proof your brand is the name of it. Number two, my first day in Ghana, which is episode 19. And then number one, my top all-time favorite SPI TV episode of the year is my office tour, and uh, that's episode number two. So again, thank you so much for watching. I wish you all the best and a happy holiday. Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, all that good stuff, and a Happy New Year. I'll see you in 2016 with a new batch of episodes for SPA TV. It's going to be great. Also, uh, we are here in Austin right now filming a, a lot of bonus materials for my upcoming book, Will It Fly? How to Test Your Next Business Idea So You Don't Waste Your Time and Money. So look out for more information about that. You can visit willitflybook.com to sign up to get early information on that and the pre-orders and all that good stuff when it comes uh, becomes available. And uh, just you know, keep crushing it. So I'll see you in 2016 when a new batch of episodes episodes come out for um, for SPI TV. I really look forward to serving you through that. And again, thank you so much for your support and leave a comment. Say hi. Thanks. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Your hands blocked with a lamp. My film crew's awesome. <laughs>